40 pieces of bacon. Look at that compared to the water bottle. The thing's massive. Hey everybody, Joel Hansen here, and today we're at the Heart Attack Grill, which is freaking the most ridiculous place on earth. So basically, if you're over 350 pounds, you get to eat for free at this place. So I'm not, I don't eat for free at this place, but we're here to do their famous octuple bypass, which is a massive burger. And these burgers have the world record for being the most calorically dense burgers. In fact, this one is freaking 20,000 calories. So it's not really a challenge. You still have to pay for the burger. It comes, I think it's about 30 or 40 bucks. But it should, it's like iconic. Let's see what it is. Let's go in and let's have some fun. And let's weigh ourselves first. You do not eat for free. <laughs> Liam, get up there. You do not eat for free either. And you don't eat for free. I don't eat too tough. I was going to say <laughs> So he gets to eat for free. Obesity. Yeah, obesity. Celebrate it. Celebrate it. Literally, this is the only place I know where obesity is like celebrated. So we're all in nursing gowns, or patient gowns. Here with Blaine, here with Liam. So yeah, we're, uh, we're all set, this way we won't get messy. So you can get a pack of cigarettes with your meal, because like that's healthy. Uh, the octuple bypass burger, 20,000 calories with bacon, that's what we went with. So it's gonna be about, I don't know, 32, 33 bucks. You can get wine in a frickin' IV bag. This stuff is just absolutely ridiculous. Cash only. Tax, and you have to buy your beverages. Everything is also fried in the lard, like all of the burgers. Would not recommend any of this. Uh, standardly, it's chili, onion, tomatoes, and cheese on the burger. And you're not allowed to split the bigger burgers either. This is, oh, and free spanking, great. But unfortunately, apparently, I can't spank them back. It's like even falling like slowly. Like minute by minute. How hot is yours? Let's see, I think it's pretty hot. Alright everyone, so here we have this absolutely massive burger. Um, so we're just gonna get started on again. There's no time limit, it's not an official challenge, it's just like a must-do in Vegas challenge. 20,000 calories, dripping in lard, 40 slices of bacon, ridiculous amounts of cheese. This thing is crazy. So let's get going. So I'll start when this gets to 10. I'll start when it gets to 15. Let's start right now. I want to welcome you to what is undoubtedly the craziest and stupidest food challenge I have ever attempted. This is the octuple bypass at the Heart Attack Grill. This burger is sitting with literally 20,000 calories for one burger. This is like the ultimate cheat day in one burger. This thing is absolutely ridiculous and it is just the epitome of what this heart attack grill is all about which is literally just the most extreme food items the most unhealthy food that you can ever imagine so we were just seeing how fast we could eat this thing i didn't want to go 100 but with only having one water bottle i was definitely quite limited i wanted to see how fast i could do it i was paying for it regardless uh, overall, it was going to come to about $40. You had to pay a little extra for the bacon, tax, water, etc., etc. But anyway, let's tune on in, see what we can do. The fastest mail time that I had known of previously was Eric the Electric, sitting at about 10 or and a half minutes, I believe, or 11 minutes, somewhere in that range. We had Randy Santel sitting at 26, and an apparent record by Mickey Sudo sitting at around 6 minutes. So, with that, everybody, let's tune in. I'll let you enjoy. And in case you're wondering, yes, I definitely gained weight after this one. Additionally, I have some gym footage while I was traveling at the end of this video. So if you want to check out some gym footage, be sure to check that out. And with that, I'll let you get to the rest of the video.
people's expressions are hilarious. somewhere about six and a half minutes, something like that, maybe just over. So that is officially the fastest time a male has completed it. And then apparently Mickey Sudo, although I talked to her about this and she wasn't sure about it, apparently she did this in about five minutes, 45 seconds, or just under six minutes. So if that's the case, she's a beast. But anyway, um, the hardest part about this challenge, I don't know if you noticed this, we gotta pay for water bottles, so I was trying to do this with one water, so that definitely slowed me down a little bit. But I'm about six and a half minutes going at a not 100% pace, not too bad. So everybody who's done this slower, you're just slow, and no, I'm just kidding. So everybody, thanks for watching, appreciate it. This place is very unique, so if you're ever in Las Vegas, definitely come at least check out the Heart Attack Grill, but maybe don't order this. So that was 20,000 calories in like six minutes. So everybody, thanks again, and until next time, you know what to do. And Liam just finished. Liam's time was about, uh, for the double was what, I don't know. About 20 minutes. Let's say about, about 20 minutes, two patties. Blaine actually crushed his. I don't know how long you took, but like two minutes. So Blaine should have done the October next time, I guess. So here's the bill. Note it says medical services, tax, government theft. And there is their total. So there we go. That is the octubal bypass damage, plus what it's doing to my gut right now, and my health. Look at this, look at us, just look at us. And afterwards, Liam sitting at a, somehow Liam lost weight. <laughs> what the heck? No, I'm just kidding, yeah. Heart attack grill, we want a refund. Go for it, dude. Man, I think the scale's just messed up, because Liam lost weight. 
I think you lost weight too. Oh, two pounds, two pounds. Yeah, there you go. I lost 15 pounds, yeah! See, like, that's more accurate now. Yeah. So now you're probably wondering, what actually does the Heart Attack Grill food taste like? Because we were definitely wondering that. So, Mr. Blam, what do you actually think about the Heart Attack Grill food? Very greasy, <laughs> but good. Yeah, like, I was expecting it to be like, not great tasting, because I've heard some things, but besides being very, very greasy, it actually tasted pretty reasonable. Yeah. Liam, what do you think about the Heart Attack Grill burgers? I'd give it a six out of 10, better than I thought. Yeah, like, maybe it's because we had really low expectations going in. But it was like, it wasn't bad. Like if we didn't know it was cooked in grease and everything, it would just be like, yeah, like it would just be a, like, oh, that's not a bad burger. So, I mean, if you do go, it's not like you won't enjoy the food. It's just probably not the best thing you've ever had and it is bad for your health, so. And good morning, everybody. So this is day two in Vegas. Um, the best way I'm going to describe my trip so far and Vegas so far, change the lighting, and it's a little, a little softer for you is Vegas is absolutely ridiculous and although you hear it's ridiculous you won't understand how ridiculous it is unless you actually go. So I am did a lot of eating yesterday, uh, super bloated, so I'm just going to kind of go to the fitness center a little bit. I don't really know what they have but I know they have something. Uh, I'm going to just do a little bit of something, maybe like, I don't know, walk for 15 minutes or like something, I don't know, maybe do a few light, light, light weights. Um, Always, you know, wear uh, proper um, shoes and equipment, everybody, when you're going to the gym. I didn't bring gym shoes, so I'm like, so I'm not gonna like run or anything. But anyway, let's go check that out. We'll see what else the Sites Vegas has to offer. It's pretty crazy so far.
And Vegas by day looks significantly different than at night. Like for example, see that big steel thing? That's the over, like the overdome, the lighted over screen. Looks very different in the daytime. 